yeah just make sure y'all ain't got no apps running in the background um make sure you don't got no any other devices sitting next to you because it's you know y'all connection it would be messed up or hard to hear you so just make sure y'all got everything together now nah nah you know you you in the blinds baby just come back if you know if he's still here baby doll hello hi hey hey Jerome. i talked to you once before and i've been crying i'm driving but anyway i just want to thank you because when you were talking about how what you went through with her and how it affected you i was one of the ones who told you you know your son needed you because if it affected you like it's as an adult you can imagine what's going on with him and i just want to thank you for sharing with us because we do love him i love all the children but he he just stood out to me all the time and when you were talking about him learning he used to cry to do homework so he's not slow he wants to learn so mm -hmm. i just want to share that with you and thank you and 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 again you know i'm i'm a type of person i take information in so mm -hmm. and i'm thankful for the people who said certain things rather than comments or to me because i needed i needed that tough love that night um mm -hmm. i needed that hey y'all hey, good evening everybody um i just wanted to say oh uh, god bless y'all and gerard I noticed the difference from when you first came on and you were bashed a lot, but you kept your truth saying, I might need to go to psychiatrist to see something that's too much for me. <laughs> but guess what? All praise be to God. And it's so easy for somebody to judge somebody, but you're not in their shoes. And, mm -hmm. and you turn around that quick. So all the praises you getting amongst all the praises you didn't get that day, because I remember everybody bash you. Oh, brother, you don't want to stand up and all that but you kept it honest this is a lot for me i didn't notice that lady told me stay out just pay me and you abide by the wishes because it's easy to protect your spirit and your energy but guess what what god got for you can't nobody stop you know mm -hmm. and even though and even then when they were bashing you when you first came on you didn't say a bad word you didn't say nothing bad about her. you just said y'all understand i'm protecting my energy and you moved in God's way. You didn't move in the people's way. You moved in your way. And look what God has done. And I, I fall short of the glory, and I'm not perfect. But I'll say this. If you don't believe in God, look at Gerard in this situation and every sister that sat on this panel that held him down. Sometimes we want to shit to move in our way it ain't about our way because at the end of the day it's his call it's, it's on him and i just want to say god bless you god bless the panel everybody and anybody that judged him you have no jurisdiction on the uh, mighty god if that if, if, yeah and god bless you <laughs> Moesha. you did that brother Thank you. <laughs> you sat through all the yeah. torment and all the name calling and you didn't allow it to move you because mm -hmm. when you move it in god's way it can't nothing be done with you and that's it that's all i gotta say thank you reveal the truth thank you yes ma'am yeah and that that was a that was a a lot of people may not know when i did that with charlie i had only knew about information for about maybe less than 48 hours so mm -hmm. i was i was under a kind of i was in a state of shock for a lot of stuff um and i was i was angry i was a lot of emotions but i, I remember that day it was one girl and i'll never forget it it's it's things that that make you change the, your your conversation that you never forget the girl i told that girl that she was being too emotional and I and I mm -hmm. and I thought about that and I said I would never tell my sons you being too emotional. And that's what changed my attitude about the whole that whole interview was I just said something I wouldn't even tell my own sons. Um and so that day I had just got through the information and I needed to step back and just pay attention to things, you know. And right. another thing, I've 
let me say this. My my I was y'all see me now, but I was raised by a street. My brothers were street dudes. So the way you do things in the street is you move in silence. Right. So when I said I was thinking about it, when I said I was thinking about it, I went mm -hmm. back to my brother, how my brothers taught me how we do it in the streets. You move mm -hmm. silent. You back up. You say little. You watch everybody. You watch everything. And, mm -hmm. you, and you move in silence. And that's what I chose to do. No, and you did, and that was wonderful, and that's what I like. I applaud you, you know, with as well, because mm -hmm. you you could have, you know, got angry, you could have got mad, you could have been like, forget this, I ain't dealing with this shit. You know, I pay my child support, so I ain't got to You you didn't do that. You you stepped up, and and you you was that you know that honest man, and I respect you for that. You understand what I'm saying? Because it you just don't find you know too many men like you and and i want to say thank you for doing that because you know like i said i'm gonna keep stressing it hezekiah is my baby and i was ready to go to detroit that's, and kick her that's why <laughs> and i'm gonna tell you this babe. and that's and that's one of the, and, and one of the reasons why i was i was willing to to talk to you is because you know saying you you you've been solid about that since day one since i talked to you you like that's my boy you better take care of him so right uh, I, I still want jeremiah really bad it. but i'm sorry i do listen when i, I met jeremiah him, bad behind when i, I met do, him, I want him when i met him i wanted to take him too but they did put something in the paperwork she she wanted it in there i believe that wouldn't allow us to take any other kid so oh, wow. i would have loved to take him i would have loved to take take him i have friends i had my friend uh said to me if don't nobody take the twins i'll i'll take them my i have i had people that were willing to step up outside of me to take on any of the kids um that's just how the people around me are we we don't just look at the one that belonged to me we were looking at all of them and saying if we tell tell cps we'll take them you know what I'm saying? That's what we do. That's that's the support he got is we taking care of all of them. So. But again, thank y'all for, for the comments. <laughs> thank y'all for 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 yeah, saying something I to love, me. I love Jeremiah. I break yeah. him like a wild stallion. I love to have that little boy. <laughs> and I got some more people in the queue. OK. OK. Hey, um, can you hear me? Just to make sure before I say anything. You you sound kind of low, baby. If you want to just turn your yeah. volume up a little bit. Okay. Can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah I can hear you. Okay. So, um, I just have a question about when you first went to go get Hezekiah, because um, from what I was hearing, that he didn't really know that he had a father to begin with. So, how did that interaction right. go? Like, was he scared, timid? I don't know if you went over it. Yeah, was... came in a little late. Listen, man, he it this this is the one thing I remember. He is his mother is Muriel. So it's not a lot of fear, you know, she has. Mm -hmm. So I don't think he was afraid. Uh he was excited more than anything when uh because when I got there, Cooper was putting the girls in the uh car seat. Me and Cooper kind of got there at the same time. Uh Cooper was putting the girls in the car seat, he was getting them together. They had all, you know, Matthew was running over there, hugging on everybody. Uh, and then I came in. And so everybody thought I was with Cooper, uh, but they just don't, didn't know me. So when I told the lady, I'm here to pick up Hezekiah, I'm his dad. That's when he looked at me and stared at me and started smiling. Oh, uh, y'all about to give me choked up to again. I hear things like this. Uh, <laughs> no, because, and, uh, you know, when we're watching on like, the app, it was just, we thought, like, the kids had no family, no hope outside of Muriel and her little people. So, honestly, I'm surprised and I'm happy that he actually does have a support system outside of that toxicity because it was really bad. Yeah. Like, just watching at that least, every day. It was terrible. At least the kids, at least the kids have a support group outside of that maybe not her she may have burned her bridges but right. i don't think the kids have burned their bridges which is good because they're and and i know that to be true because when i saw those kids interact with each other 
they still they through all of the stuff that they went through they still found a way to love each other that's why mm -hmm. i want to and i will try my hardest to keep him in contact with his brothers and sisters i think that's going to be very important to the development of him being with me and the development of him being a man as he grow get older uh but our first interaction i wanted to hug him i wanted to hug on him and kiss on him but he was ready to go he he said bye to them and, and he was at the door before i was and uh i got him in the car and he went he took a nap he went to sleep so he at least felt comfortable enough in the car to go all right i'll sleep in front of these people <laughs> so he was comfortable uh and, and like i said i didn't love on him really until it was time to to get him in the house he came in he took a shower you know i bought him some night clothes oh shoot i'm sorry y'all hold on just wanna... yeah um hold on my connection Hello. dropped hold on just one second Hold on. My, if Gerard, if you can hear me, you want to get back in the queue. Hold on just one second. I'm sorry, y'all. My connection dropped. I'm sorry. I'm not sure if y'all connection, but it's, it seemed like it's taking y'all a while to get on the panel. I apologize, y'all. My connection. <laughs> My connection dropped. Okay, y'all still here. Okay, thank you. I'm sorry. That's my fault. I apologize. I don't know what happened. My shit dropped. Um, Gerard and Velvet, come just come back in the queue because I'm gonna I'm gonna let y'all back down. Hold on, let's see. And then I'm gonna bring y'all back up. Hold on, let me see where y'all at. Oh my goodness, what is this doing? Hold on, I don't know what the hell is going on. Okay, here we go. Okay, Gerard, I'm sorry. I do apologize for that. That was my fault. You fine. <laughs> yeah, um, let me put you back in the big box. But your question it was it was a it was a cool meeting and he was and he was pretty he was happy and and I think I was happy and, and it was a good night. Okay, that is so wonderful. I got Scorpio Sniper coming up. Hey Gerard. Oh, <laughs> Hey. Every time I had like them, first of all, let me say, do I, um, I know sometimes just me as a person, sometimes my, my thoughts and opinions can come across as, um, um, as a bit harsh. So let me apologize to you if I made you feel, um, no, 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 no. You never apologize. You will never apologize to me. The way you came off is if, if is somebody who concerned. I, listen, I'm 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 not timid. I've been around enough strong women and strong black women to know when when you're being malicious and when you're not. And you never were malicious. You told me exactly what I needed to hear as a person who hasn't been around his son and as a person who was thinking about himself and not the well-being of his son. Don't ever apologize for that. You were absolutely 100 percent right for that. OK, well, because be I the sister wife. By the way, respectfully, my father was not around for many years due to my own mother's actions, and then my brother took a back seat to his own son's life because he had a, a baby's mother that was very vindictive as well. So I'm like, I'm it was personal for me. It's like, no, stop allowing these females to dictate what type of relationship you're going to have with your kids. Be involved. Go, you know, so I'm glad. Um, I'm glad you did your thing. 
I'm 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 glad that 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 you you didn't take a back seat. I'm I'm glad yeah. you worked your set behind the scenes. Um, you're like a dope guy. Your your smile is going from here to there. Um, it, it's it's bittersweet because you know, as a mother, you want the children to I be can't... raised with their mother. It's just it's just a natural thing. But um, I think this is best for him. You know, I, I hope. If Miriam was looking in the window, which we know she is, you know, for me personally, I want to see her get, I want to see her get well. I want to see her get better. I want to see her be an active mother in her children's lives. I want to see you, Cooper, Patrick, Miriam, all the kids, your wife. I want to see y'all be each other's builders because I think that's what those children are going to need. I don't know if mm-hmm. it's possible, but that's my hope. <laughs> I, I, and and that's kind of and that's kind of and that's kind of my thing too and that that was one of the reasons why I wanted you know them not to fight online um her and Cooper but I I had to also realize too that you know what I'm saying I was not previewed to certain things so when I went online and I told you know trying to tell Cooper and her to stop I didn't know that she had said something about his mama listen listen oh. If Cooper, if Cooper listen, if Cooper listen, I apologize. When she says something about moms, all gloves is off. I apologize for even coming at him and telling him to stop and chill out because I get that. You don't talk about moms. You know what I'm saying? You don't talk about moms. You don't talk about dads. And so I apologize. I, you know, I've never been able to apologize to Cooper about that, but I apologize about that. Because, oh, uh, parts in the comments, y'all. You breaking up, um, again, Gerard. We can't hear you if you're talking. Can you hear me now? Yeah, we can hear you. All right. Can you hear me? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, but yeah, but you know, with, did you have anything I, else? I, oh, go ahead. No, no, that that was that was just it. I'm I'm glad things are working out. I'm glad things are moving in a a a, a healthy direction. Um, I'm I'm just glad I'm glad for Hezekiah. He looks like he's thriving. You look like you thriving. I know it's a huge adjustment, but like you said, just. Just keep praying about it. Just keep allowing God to guide you. Just keep allowing God to put positive people in your life. Everybody won't have your best interests at heart, but if you allow God to to lead you and to guide you and to tell you and to tap into your gift of discernment, then you you won't go wrong. And um, I'm glad it worked out. I'm glad it worked out. Yeah. Thanks. And God. again, and again, you. And you and and you personally know what's up. I I contacted you on I kind I sent you a message and let you know. I didn't you send did. a lot of people messages, but I I made sure you knew. I told you, you did, you, and I, you, I was you 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 sniper me with that one for real. You hit my heart <laughs> yeah, with that one. You but did. you know what? I had a father that was absent because of my mother. My brother was absent out of my nephew's life because of his baby mama. So I'm like. It it, it 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 was personal and you i'm ain't... like come on now you didn't and sound I... like a bad guy yeah you sound you yeah. sounded like a solid and, and, and guy. i get it nothing she said about you was was bad like i didn't pick up negative vibes like where the fuck is he at come on move it gerard <laughs> so yeah <laughs> and i needed it and, and i and i got moving i got moving i just i just you did. I just said I had to move, move. I had to just, just, you know, just like you sniper me in the heart. I had to move like a sniper. I had to back up, aim, pay attention, and figure out and figure out how I was gonna go forward. So thank you. And you did it. No, thank, thank you. Now I'm gonna get down because I like to cry. Bye, Gerard. <laughs> All right, now she's <laughs> she trying to be chose, Gerard. Watch out, she trying to be chose. <laughs> She's so silly. <laughs> and like I said, y'all make sure y'all connection is on point because if you take too long to come up, 
or if you know you come up and there's something going on, then you know I'm gonna have to drop you because we got other people needing, and we don't want to yeah. take too much of his time. And and you, and yeah, you know you just let me know that. when you're ready. And I'm probably gonna do another ten minutes. It's almost it's like seven twenty here, uh -huh. so I do it to seven thirty, and then I want to get in there and and hang out. I know them. that's right. I know that's right. Just and 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 truly, since he since he allowed me to do this, I, I don't want to I don't want to take away too much of his time. Right. And um, again, if his mother is in here, he is doing fine, and he does love you. Yeah, I don't. I'm never going to change that in him, and I'm never going to let him feel any type of way about you. And you ain't never got to worry about me talking negative about you, because that ain't that ain't my relationship with you and that you know that's not how i get down i know that's right and, and and that's the right thing you know like i said don't you know don't let that girl take you out of your character and you know take you yeah. off the track that you need to be on to be able to provide and love your son so um yeah. okay i guess that person gotta hear you go true i'm about to add you but but you but y'all need to quit calling them. Y'all need to quit calling them villagers. Y'all need to call them children of the corn. <laughs> some of them people is lost. Some of them people acting like zombies and crazy. Yes, they are. Hey, true. Can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Yes. Okay, how y'all doing? Hi, Gerard, and congratulations. Right. And thank you for being who you are. Just a couple of questions. When is um Hezekiah's birthday? His birthday is July eighth. It's actually as oh, funny, funny you asked me that. Yeah, cancer. Uh, it's it's a couple day man. Let me tell you, I'm so glad I get along with cancers. I love cancers. Some of my I love good friends are cancers. You know, what I'm saying? a Leo. They petted in a mug. So I'm right behind. They petted in a mug, but boy, I love mm -hmm. me some cancers. And Amen. they good petty too. They that good petty. That's they that I'm mad at you for seven years. And you and, and, and I ain't getting over it until you apologize. I love cancers, but keep going. <laughs> <laughs> God bless you. And one more question. Um, so for Muriel, does the child support stop? Um, it's so right let, at this point? let me tell let me let me talk about that too. She said that the payments weren't going through, and um, after she said that, I'm gonna I'm gonna be completely honest with you, she told me that. And I went and I got on top of it and I made sure she was getting uh, she got her money. She was getting the money for child support. She I know that's right. To, she never had to ask twice. So I those know she couple didn't. months. So those couple months that she um, that she didn't get, not only did I pay for those couple months, but I also gave her more money and they were taking it out of check. As of right now, she's still continuing to get child support from me until what? we. we we do a cancellation. Yeah, listen, listen. Until I get, until we, uh, I don't want to talk about what I'm doing, but until until we cancel it out, yes, she will still be getting it. Don't worry, I'm working on it. Holy but, crap! Um, but but listen, man. My whole thing is, I one, I take care of my child, and two, if the mother's asked, I make sure I get it. So that that was the thing. I know I that's right, sure and I believe that. It. I believe you. You know, I totally beyond believe all of you. that, and beyond all of that is it really is just money, because money, money cannot make me feel the way I felt when I saw him that damn Thursday at, at, at almost eight o'clock. I know and it. That that money ain't going None of that money made me feel the way I felt when I saw him. Nothing made. And that's nothing, my last question. What you just uh, said just there. <laughs> that's my last. This is my last question. When that moment, I don't know if you said it. I came in a lot late, but that moment when you brought him and took him to your house, and when he saw his new siblings, like how was the interaction? I, I want to hear all that happy stuff. How was that when we kind of, you know, sat down? They gave him his space, and then right. it was full on playing video games, hanging out with him, eating together. Uh, he, it was it was just they was you know on him um my interaction with him came really came when he was eating and uh i was at the table and he was at the table i wasn't eating i was just watching him eat 
And then he just looked at me watching him eat and he just smiled and I just smiled back at him. <laughs> and so it was like, oh my goodness. we ain't need no words. We was just, it was like, yo, look, he's, Gerard, you know, I was like, my yo, birthday is July. Kid. Listen, my birthday is July 28th. You owe me a pair of mink eyelashes, okay? Because I cried through this whole live <laughs> and had to destroy my lashes. So July 28th, I'm looking for something in the mail. <laughs> I got you, girl. I got you. <laughs> and that's all I had to say. God bless you. God bless all of you. You, Gerard, you made this whole live happy. You made this whole live happy. Like, this, it made my day. Listen, we don't... I don't, I don't have, I don't, I don't have a, listen, I've been through too much to, to have, you know, negative things. And, and, and again, I tell you, my 17 year old has been, and, um, and so I've learned how to, to, to respect certain things. And, and, and as a dad, and I say it like this out of respect for his mom, and I know people hated it. I do it alone, not single. And I do it alone out of respect for his mom because his mom is still there, even though she isn't present every day. She's still there. And um, um, but as I was doing it alone, I started to appreciate things and, and women and 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 singleness and everything. But I don't have no time to be upset. It's, this should be a happy conversation. And, and I think it has been. Mm -hmm. Amen. So thank you for coming up and thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And God bless you. Hey, big girl. How you doing? Hey, how you doing? Oh, I'm trying to get out of the way. Yeah, how about you? Can y'all hear me? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Yeah, now we can. I just wanted to say congratulations. Um, on the reunite, re reuniting with your child, with your son. Congratulations. And I just want to let everybody know it is absolutely a lot of strong dads out here and dads who cared. I went through the same situation when I was a little girl with my parents. And guess what? Guess who came to save us from defects? Y'all call it uh, DHS, CPS. That's what y'all call it, but it's defects where I live. Okay. My dad came to save us as well. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it hurt it. It really hurt me when I stepped into this live and you was here. I just, it just brought some tears down. But I'm going to just get down because I don't like for my kids to see me cry. But I want to say congratulations, <laughs> stay blessed, and keep doing you. And, and, and to, to my more. You're breaking up. Something that went through Gerard, my, it's hard to hear you. I'm is. sorry. If I'm in it, okay. you're breaking up real bad. Okay, can you it's hear me like, now? It's real choppy. Okay, yeah, there you go. Okay. All right, am I back? Yes. Yes. How do it sound now? Okay. You sound great. So mm -hmm. so that's another thing. That's another thing too that 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 I had to deal with too is you know, I had to really I had to really say to myself that he needs me i haven't been there for eight years and he really needs me now there's no way i get listen only god can give you second chances i swear to god only god can give you second chances and i feel like this is the second chance that he gave me and and ain't no way ain't no way i'm gonna fuck this one up ain't no uh -huh, way i'm gonna right. fuck this one up I, I i mean sorry for saying it like that but that's all i kept saying in my head is i ain't messing this one up and you and so better when not, because you know you got me on your ass, Gerard. You know I, 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 I go there and, with and, you. As, and, 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 and you see Scorpion, put a Scorpio out there. Scorpio on your ass. Yeah. I put Sorry. Scorpio on you so <laughs> fast. <laughs> you know we ain't so, so that's one of the things I thought about. I, I said to myself, I can't fail him twice. Especially if God gave me a chance. I can't fail him twice. You that's better not want to. You bet not won't. I'm not. Somebody hey, asked, do I want to I, I do, but it ain't up to me. Right. That's a fact. Hey, boom. Hello, everyone. Hey, y'all. How are you guys doing today? Um, I just want to say last time you were um, in an interview, I asked you a question about um, if you could see 
yourself in him. And at that time, you you kind of were, you know, still unsure about the whole situation. So now can you look at him and see features, see things that remind yourself of yourself? So feature wise, no. I'm I'm not really good at looking at my me and my wife argue about this all the time because I don't look at my boys and think they look like me. But personality, Jesus, that boy. When I when I say my son is 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 my 17 year old is is very competitional, like and he has that. I think my son is like that because I'm I'm very competitional. I, I competition is like in my heart. Uh, I don't always compete against people. I've always competed. I'm you know, normally competing with myself, but I see things in his personality that's like my other boys. That's like me. Mm -hmm. So, I, mm -hmm. so the more that I'm watching him, I see certain things as he talks and as he do things. Um, that's like me. That like like the whole not backing down, even though how small he is, that was me. You know. Um, <laughs> so it's things. You know what I'm saying? His mouth is all his mama, <laughs> but that's cool. <laughs> that's cool. You know, I can see me and I can see her in him. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. I, I'm I. I'll manage that. I can manage that that stuff with him. But yes, I'm starting awesome. to see some things. That is awesome. And last thing, I don't want. I don't have another question. I just want to big you up for doing the work you were supposed to do while he was growing up. Because had you not done that work with therapy and you know ensuring that you're emotionally intelligent, you wouldn't have been prepared to just step up the way you did. So all the things that have happened, that's water under under the bridge. And so I just want to big you up for you know ensuring that you are emotionally okay. So kudos to you. Yeah, and and I recommend other men too that yo you you need to figure check that out because it, that that allows me to not be up here and say anything negative about her. That's also allowed me to 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 you know be in a unsure situation. Like I I was nervous to go and see him, but I think that therapy and a lot of stuff and friends and stuff helped me uh, to deal with certain things. Hey, Juicy. I'm not sure. That's why y'all want to, you know, come up, make mm -hmm. sure that y'all connection is on point. Um, Nobody else is in the queues. Or did anybody else have any questions before he go? Because he only got a couple more minutes. Okay, hold on just for a second. There you go. Hey Cooper, how you doing? Yes, I mean, Gerard, yes, Gerard. How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. I would get offended okay. if I ain't like Cooper. I think Cooper is a cool dude. So go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I was wondering, did you ever look at the videos where um it was bought out house? <laughs> I hate to say it, but I just want to know that Samaya was touching on him. Did you ever see those videos? So, so I'm I'm glad you brought that up because I'm a I'm a talk about. Uh, and like again, I so, said I'm I'm sorry I didn't mean to bring that up, but I just wanted to know. I'm sorry. And just no, mute no, yourself, no, no, Granny, because it's I, an echo. Okay, I'm gonna drop down. So, so it's all right. It's cool that you brought that up because. Um, that's one of the things I didn't do is I didn't let my wife watch any of the videos and I didn't watch my boys watch any of the videos. The one thing is I didn't want them to have a level of anger or anything. So I asked them, could they please not watch it or try to look it up? And they respected my wishes. I wanted when Hezekiah came into the house, they looked at him as Hezekiah and not what hey, he had been going through in this house. We did talk about some things but we didn't go into great detail they trust they trust that i can hold certain things and i'll give them the information they need it so with that being said um i did watch some videos as much as i could because some videos is just too much for me as a as a dad and, and as a thing but there are certain things that i i he will be going to therapy for because there's some things that I can deal with and there's some things that I can't deal with. I've never been touched 
if he was touched, I've never been touched. So that's that's an area I can't help him with. So I'm going to need somebody that's more professional than myself to talk to him to reveal some things. He's been I know through some videos he's been coached. So to decoach him, I have to, he needs to go to therapy so somebody can help him decoach you know, some of the things that have been going on. So there's some things that I do. I am, he will be going to therapy, um, but I haven't even had him a week yet. Uh, and I ain't got him in school yet. So all of that stuff going to come in time. Hello. Can you hear Hi. me? Yes, ma'am. Hi, Ty and Black Velvet. Hello. Hi. Hello, Gerard. Hi. How are you? I don't right. have a question. I just want to say congratulations. My heart is so full for my baby Hezekiah. I'm telling you, that's my boy. <laughs> Ooh, him and Matthew, those are <laughs> my two. So when you do get that list going, please make sure that these ladies get it in their inbox because, honey, I am going to load up. I, ooh, you just don't know. I am just so elated because he's I, um... okay. And to know the things that he heard about you in the past and just look at you guys now, man, I can just, I can just see the future, man. You just don't know. I am. Um, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get the list together. Uh, somebody is going to help me uh, put a list together and, and help and, and get me going. I'm not, I'm not used to anything. I'm not used to it, but um, I did, I did say, you know, out of out of a natural respect for for certain people, I did say I was going to come back on here and give an update. So I've I've done two updates right now, and I said I was going to do three. So it, there is a third one I'm going to do out of respect. Uh, I did ask Hezekiah. I always ask that little dude, "Is he okay with doing it?" So right. I, hopefully, by the time I do that last one, it will be up. I'm I promise to work on it. Okay, well, take your time, but I just, you know, like I said, make sure the ladies get it, because like I said, I'm just so happy, and you know, that way they can get things, and summertime's coming up, if he ain't got a bicycle, mm -hmm. I'm your girl, I'm <laughs> telling you, I want this child to have a we, childhood, I want him gonna, to do we, things that yeah. little boys do. <laughs> we gonna, we gonna, we gonna get them together, uh, and, and, and what I mean that, I mean the family, and, and, and if y'all want to give anything, that's, that's, because he he again man he's a good kid and he deserves he, he deserves is. it um, he do i'm looking forward i'm looking forward to this snow being gone so we can you know figure it out we are me and my wife and and this is off the this is off the topic and i'm about to get off when i after i say this um now I've got six boys so it's six boys so um <laughs> uh with six boys and we like taking family vacations we we love hanging out with the boys so now i gotta look at a bigger vehicle um and uh i might I, i've been fighting my wife for, for about a year or so about getting a minivan and we gonna we take so you can get and that the world is way bigger than the city Okay. Well, you All just right. enjoy Can it. You Thank me? you for letting me come up, guys. I appreciate it. I just wanted to let you know. Take your time getting it done because we still, trust and believe, we still going to be here for Hezekiah. Believe me. So take your time and get settled yeah. and everything, but we still going to be here and enjoy. Thank you so much. No problem. Can you hear me? Yeah, we can, can hear you. Hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah right, we can yeah. hear you. I was, I was just saying. I was just saying we're gonna be taking some trips when the weather break. It's it's still snowing here, but I can't wait. We love taking the boys out for new experiences and, and he gonna have a lot of new experiences. We like to go hiking, we like to go swimming, we like to go to the lakes, we like to we like to learn new things, see new stuff. And here in Michigan, we like to go up north and, and hang out in the forest. You know what I'm saying? We do all type of stuff. I'm into my boys being boys. So I'm 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 excited for him to get used to life outside of just the 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 uh the city. Trying to go on vacation with y'all. This sound like fun no, to me. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Man, we had listen, 
listen, we have, man, we have a ball. Um, we do. We, but, but again, a book I read, um, and I and I apply it to my life. Raise your kids like keep like people you like. So if you raise your kids like people you like, you want to be around them, and it's easy to do vacations and do trips. You know what I'm saying? We'll we can come up with the money, but those times of you know, being in a room, being in a hotel room or being in a cabin, you know what I'm saying? Just what for them, you know, watching VHSs because we we got a lot of forests out here that don't have internet reception. That's what I really like. When the kids don't can't be on the internet and all they gotta watch is VHSs and they get back to just hanging out and campfires. I like doing that with the boys because we don't know how I don't know my boys getting older and they're going to be out of the house. And I don't know how many times they're going to be able to do stuff like that. So I appreciate times like that. So heck yeah, I'm waiting for the weather to break for us to take trips. And this, and, you, and the way you sound, Gerard, it's just like, you, you sound so happy and like filled with joy. And I'm just like, I appreciate that. I really do. Like, I, I really love this, this moment right here. This is, you know, like I said, Lakaya is my boy. I cannot stress it <laughs> long enough. I really can't because I, I don't play when it comes to him. You know what I'm saying? When they were saying that, somebody <laughs> came over to my live talking about Ezekiah in the corner. I went over there and said, get my son out that dang old corner. <laughs> or, on the wall or wherever she put him on. So, listen, you know, I listen, I don't care what, I don't care what nobody <laughs> say. Listen, I don't care what nobody say. I'm 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 always a certain way. Uh, but that video was funny. I'm gonna not lie to you. I, I, I he was only trying to irritate her by repeating everything she said. You know, if I was in the house as a dad, I would have been like, hey, you stop doing that. Later on in the night, I would have probably told him that was kind of funny, but don't do that to your mom because you don't want her to go off. And I ain't got time for to be getting in trouble for laughing. That's how I would have handled it. <laughs> right. But it was kind of funny, and y'all know it. Because she said, what, hit the wall, and he hit the wall. She, 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 he going to hit the wall. Right. <laughs> that boy. That, that boy. So, um, <laughs> so, uh, all right, I'm going I'm to get off of here, and I'm going I'm to get in there and cook for him and, and hang out with him. Um, no, that's right. for the rest of the and night. It, and again, thank you so, 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 so much for you, you know, uh, thank, updated with everything. I yeah, appreciate and thank it. You. And thank you for being, and thank you for being understanding about certain things. Even when, you know what I'm saying? I came to you and I talked to you on, on, on the back end. You were willing to, yo, this is between me and you. Yo, I'll share this with very limited people. And even your your words of just be careful, I, those yeah. were were great. So you've been a solid, you know what I'm saying. I'm I, I'm gonna be honest with you. I've only I'm on this. I've only came and did interview with solid people. I've only talked right. to solid people that was good on the back end and whatnot. So I wouldn't even right. did this if I didn't think you were a, a a a good person. And and I I sat back and I listened to some things you said, but. <laughs> All right. And I, and uh, I thank you I for that. I need to get off thank of here. You. Okay, yeah. You know, mix him.